Greetings and salutations, this is Pandora the Ecliptic, and I wanted to do a video on a particular subject. As you see, I'm kind of skipping my typical opening, but, but I finally found something about which you know, has fucking annoyed me. And don't get me started on the stuff of the origin. Yeah, no, I don't have an agenda against anyone. Also ah, fuck it. Oh, uh, uh, yes. Um, the struggles of a Ramadan fast in a non Muslim office. Yeah. Yeah, first I was watching something by. I think it was the the vote thing, which I'm gonna probably do a video on later, just because I think it needs to be done. And, uh, but let's get through this log fest. This month of Ramadan, over two million Muslims are fasting from sunup to sundown. For those of us who work nine to five on an empty stomach, and without caffeine, our life comes from us. Okay. First of all, why even work there? Why, why work at all? Maybe you should take this time the fuck off. Take off your 40 days of fasting. You know? If that's what you're doing. Okay? I fucking hate Lint, but I sure as damn well don't, don't try to make other people give up something. Hey. Okay. That they shouldn't have to. Okay. okay. But, yeah. The first thing you notice is that your co workers tend to ask you the same questions a lot. So, you're fasting. Okay, basically, we're not supposed to ask you those questions because you get offended too easily over it. Because, oh god, no, of course, there's anyone who wants to know about your religion, even though I don't know why I would have anything to do with your fucking religion. And, and is exactly what it is. No, we understand fasting, you wrong. We also understand that your form of fasting is completely stupid. Because I'm sorry, um, I don't care what age you are, drink some damn water. We can't go more than a few hours without it. You know, it's like seconds without air, maybe a few hours without water, and I say a few. And then, in days without food. Days like three at best. That's before it starts becoming complete you know, starvation. But, and guess what? It's a fucking stupid idea. At the end of itself. It is a stupid practice that needs to go the fuck away. And I'm sure you'll say the same with Lent. I'm a Christian. By the way, I don't plan on ever practicing Lent next year anyway. I think it's stupid that anyone compares the struggle that they had giving up a can of soda uh, that they drink every week to what Jesus had to suffer through in the desert. A 
again. Yeah. Why do this? Why the fuck do this? Exactly. What is the fucking point of it? Other than to, yeah, someone in a book that you worship and know nothing of what he looks like, by the by, know nothing about him personally, you fucking worship. Oh my god, I hate this sort of thing all the time. Fuck you, F Post. And there's always your one friend who's determined to find you. Yeah, because him being helpful and telling you, yeah, maybe there's a way of getting around it. Because guess what? There are tons of sects of different Muslims and Christians. Why? Because some of them agreed what was what was in it, and some didn't. Just like every other fucking religion. But no, 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 no. Muslims are that special little snowflake of fuck you that said, no, nope, no, nope, this is exactly what you're supposed to do. And if you go against it, we, we will, you know, Muhammad himself will kill you. Fuck that. You know, I'm sorry. Especially in countries like Qatar, where they're practically killing their own fucking people, because yeah, we can do that, and also be, and also host these parties where uh, we have prostitutes and we be, we drink like crazy people. I'm not saying I think anyone should drink in the desert. God damn, it's too fucking hot, and you know, dehydrate yourself even more, moron. But still, oh, and the climate and culture, but you don't have to do that. Yeah, exactly. What's the fucking point anymore? Well, I should be honest, what's the fucking point of religion altogether? Yeah, just think about it. What if you need whatever you want, and then afterwards, you just make yourself normal? Look, dude, I can eat a sandwich. Right now, the whole point is that I'm choosing not to. I'm sorry, I just missed getting lunch. That's why you're choosing not to. And I repeat again, the only reason why you're choosing not to do it is because your stupid faith, which is built off of what? Nothing. I'm sorry, no one is trying to punish you. No one is trying to hurt you. Go fuck yourself. Yeah, so I'm going to assume that whole Orlando shooting was that guy being a better person. I'm going to assume the San Bernardino thing was them being a better person. Um, I also assume that when was the other guy? Oh yes, the people who did that Texas shooting, okay? Because someone drew their her idol, oh God, as far as I'm calling him. If you don't know if he exists or not, he might as well not exist at all, as far as I'm concerned. Huh, or what he looks like, at least. <laughs> He's a moron. <sighs> yeah, yeah, your religion really tries to teach people how to be better people. Yeah, all religions seem to do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure they do. It's not the person, the fucking cells doing it. 
No, it's the fucking religion. Yeah, fuck that. This idea of her too. And by the way, the reason why he told you or tried to get you out of it, which by the way, this is a slight against Jews. I saw that comment down here that I want to show the person who made it, and I agree with him. Yeah, see, that yeah, makes sense. You would have had this slight against Jews because you are a fucking Muslim, and your book says to hate the Jews. Yeah, it makes perfect fucking sense you would do that. Doesn't help, because I'm sorry, you're also part of the group that supports the, supported or helped the Holocaust. You did so great job on that one. Huh? Possibly. I'm not entirely sure you were, but let's just be honest with ourselves. Uh, two. Oh. Huh? Huh. Okay, I, I'm just gonna wrap it up. I, I think if I say too much, it's just gonna be rambling. Okay, not that I wasn't rambling before. Just. Huff <sighs> Post, really? Fuck Ramadan. Fuck these Muslims who think, yes, everyone should cut out and this some. By the way, yeah, you being an asshole, really. Oh. Good job, you know? All he was trying to do is trying to help you, and you bit his head off. That's all you did, bitch. That's all you did. <laughs> Anyways, this is Pandora the Eclectic. <laughs> Telling you all to click subscribe, follow me on my social media, the links are down below. Also, if you want to check out this abomination of a fucking video, go right ahead. The link will also be down there. Um, all I have to say is. Why? Just why? Why Huff Post? I think this is like two weeks ago after the shooting. Yeah, yeah, we should feel sorry for Muslims during the Ramadan. So that they had a choice not to do. However, these people who were killed had, had no choice in dying, no choice in being what they were. Yeah, yeah, so fuck you. And anyone who's a regressive in the audience, go fuck yourself too. I've had it. Anyways, uh, this is Pandora telling you all to keep me frosty and, well, have a good day!